All right, today we got core. All of these moves can be done with or without weight. As you'll see here, I'm using a 15 pound weighted ball for my sit-ups. If you're using weight, you wanna sit up and press to the sky. If you're not using weight, you're gonna sit up and just reach all the way through and touch the floor. All the moves today are 30 seconds on, 15 seconds recovery in between each exercise. Next, we have flutter kicks. To make this move more difficult, again, I'm holding weight up above my chest so it's not just bringing in the abs, but the entire core. 30 seconds of flutter kicks, 15 seconds of recovery. If you are not using weight, you can put your hands on your chest or under your backside, whichever way you're comfortable. Now we're on to Russian twist. You'll see here I've switched to the dumbbell. So this is another way that you can use weight to make the exercise more difficult. But again, this can be done without weight. You'll also notice my feet are on the floor. I struggle with doing Russian twist with my feet lifted off of the floor. It's a balance thing more than it is a core strength thing, but it's something that I continue to work on. If you can lift your feet, lift them up, make the move more difficult. Here we have crunches with a leg raise. What this is doing is, is bringing the entire midsection. You'll notice my legs are not stationary and I am not pulling from behind my head. You wanna crunch the entire abdominal wall, bringing the knees to the elbows and the elbows to the knees. 30 seconds on, 15 seconds of recovery. Our next exercise will be heel touches. So here we're working those sides and those obliques. What you wanna do is have your feet flat, you're reaching side to side and squeezing as you reach for that heel. If you can't reach your heel, that's fine. Reach as far as you can. If you can reach past your heel, do so. You wanna get that full range of motion and make sure you're squeezing on each side. Now this routine you're doing here, you're looking at maybe five to six rounds through each thing. It'll take you maybe 15, 20 minutes to complete. I chose to do this after doing a two mile run. So my heart rate was already up, I'm already sweating, and I'm already out of breath, which makes all of this even more difficult. Finally, we have that elbow plank. And again, you're holding for 30 seconds. Nice flat back, tight core, elbows and toes. Hold and breathe. All right, if you gotta go down and take a breath, just take a breath, get right back in, 30 seconds on, 15 second recovery, and then we're starting right back at the top. Five to six rounds, total ab burnout, let's get it. 